morning. I'm Kitra Edelstein, and this is Hawk TV for Friday, November 3rd, and it's an E-Day. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. It's the Cover Art Contest Stay Gold Winner Edition. Submit your best artwork to Mr. Kelly by Monday, November 13th for our upcoming cover, cover for Patent Art and Literacy magazine Stay Gold. The Unionville High School boys basketball team is hosting their annual Moonlight Madness 3-on-3 three -three tournament Sunday, November 12th. A perfect day because Sunday is the Eagles' bye week. The cost per player is $25. Sign up for some friendly competition. Please see Mr. Anderson in room 148 if you have any questions. Unionville Fall Play is excited to present the Adams Family. Performance dates are next Friday, November 10th at 7 p.m. next Saturday, November 11th at 1 p.m. and 7 p.m. Tickets are available at Show Ticks for You. Hope you can make it. We're dying to see you. Attend the girls' basketball clinic with UHS basketball coaches and players. The clinic is on November 11th from 9 a.m. until noon, and the registration fee is $35. Visit the patent homepage for more information and to register. The seventh grade football team had its final game against Fugit in a hard-fought contest. Seventh grade first and only touchdown was a long punt returned by Seth Quinlan. Later in the game, Christian Molina had an interception off a deflected pass. In the end, seventh grade lost to Fugit 8-6. to six. They ended the season with a winning record of 5-2. to two. The eighth grade game got off into an incredible start as Harris Stanisawzik had a 99 yard rushing touchdown on the first offensive play for Patton. The offense kept rolling throughout the game with Gavin Barito, Dylan Liu, and Izzy Faber contributing touchdowns. John Ung had a couple of two-point conversions. On special teams, Sack King had an onside kick recovery. On defense, Robert Bahanik had a fumble recovery, Otto Dietrich, Edgar Benar, and Jamal Amira ha all had sacks coming off the defense line. Eighth grade dominated Fugit, winning 32 to zero. They ended their season with a six and one record. In their two football years, the eighth grade team only lost one game and were undefeated at home. The Patton football team would like to thank Micah Hertzinger for helping them on the sidelines at home games and Andrew Bedzak, who was the team manager. A huge thanks to the Patton cheerleaders who supported the team all season. Sixth and seventh graders, please consider joining the team next year. Later this school year, there will be more information, but if you're considering playing and have questions, see Mr. Little, Mr. Anderson, Dr. Crowley, or Mr. Huxta. Here's today's band schedule. At 8.13, 8th grade study hall. At 8.53, 7th and 8th grade makeup lessons. At 9.33, beginner bear, tone and tuba, at 12.07, sixth grade makeup lessons, at 12.47, beginner flute and saxophone, at hawk time, there's a spirit rally. Happy birthday to, on November 3rd, Dominic Brunn, Jack Murthy, and Peyton Sack. On November 4th, happy birthday to Ty Miller, and on November 5th, happy birthday to Samika and Saloka, Penemashta and Kira Sabaya. That's all for today. See you Monday for another Hawk TV. I'm Kitra Edelstein. Have a great day.